we're diving into the fascinating world of OSINT, open source intelligence. OSINT is all about gathering information from publicly available sources, and it's a field that's growing more important every day as our lives become increasingly digital. Every time we go online, we leave behind digital footprints, tiny traces of our activity that can be pieced together to form a surprisingly detailed picture of who we are, what we do, and even where we've been. The tools we'll cover in this video are incredibly powerful. They can reveal just how much personal and public information is out there for anyone to find, often with just a few clicks. It's eye-opening to see how much of our lives is accessible to others. That's why it's so important to use these tools responsibly and ethically. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility. Always respect privacy and follow the law when using OSINT techniques. This video is created purely for educational purposes, to help you understand how to protect your own digital footprint or to use these skills for legitimate professional reasons, like cybersecurity, journalism, or research. We'll be exploring 15 free OSINT tools, breaking down what each one does, how it works, and how you can use them to uncover information safely and effectively. If you're passionate about cybersecurity, digital investigations, or just want to stay informed about how to protect yourself online, make sure to hit subscribe so you don't miss any of our future deep dives and tutorials. So let's step into the shadows of the internet together, uncover the secrets hidden in plain sight, and get started on this journey into the world of OSINT. First up is Maltego, a truly versatile tool that stands out in the world of digital investigations. It's a powerhouse for mapping digital relationships, helping investigators, cybersecurity professionals, and even journalists uncover hidden connections in the digital world. With Maltego, you can start with just a single piece of information, like a domain name, an email address, or even a phone number, and instantly watch as it visually maps out a web of connections to people, websites, social media profiles, and much more, revealing relationships you might never have noticed otherwise. Its powerful transforms feature automates the process of gathering data from dozens of sources across the internet, saving you countless hours of tedious manual research and letting you focus on analysis. The free community edition is a fantastic starting point for anyone interested in open source intelligence, perfect for learning, experimenting, and personal projects, even though it comes with some limitations compared to the paid versions. Maltego's intuitive visual graphs make even the most complex networks easy to understand at a glance, turning overwhelming data into clear, actionable insights. Whether you're tracking cyber threats, investigating fraud, or just curious about how digital dots connect, Maltego is the ultimate tool for seeing the bigger picture in the digital landscape. The Harvester is a command line tool for gathering emails, names, subdomains, and more from public sources. It scrapes search engines and services like Shodan to compile a report on a target domain. It's fast, efficient, and shows how much info companies leak without realizing it, essential for mapping an organization's external attack surface. Spiderfoot automates OSINT by scanning over 100 data sources for domains, IPs, emails, usernames, and more. Just enter your target, select modules, and Spiderfoot builds a comprehensive intelligence report. Its web interface makes results easy to explore, with relationship graphs similar to Maltego. The open source version is powerful and free to use. Run a scan on your own domain. You'll be shocked at what's publicly accessible. Spiderfoot is a must-have for anyone serious about OSINT. Shodan is the search engine for the Internet of Things, indexing everything from webcams to industrial systems. It scans the Internet for connected devices and makes their details searchable. Software, versions, even default credentials. Security pros use Shodan to find vulnerable systems and exposed infrastructure. For regular users, it's a wake-up call to secure your own devices. Shodan doesn't hack, it just shows what's already open to the world. It's a powerful reminder to lock down anything you connect online. Google dorking is the art of using advanced search operators to uncover hidden files, login pages, and sensitive data. Combine operators like site, file type, and in-text to find info that shouldn't be public. The Google Hacking Database offers pre-made queries for finding vulnerabilities. It's a simple but powerful OSINT technique. Misconfigurations are everywhere. If Google can find it, so can you. Every security pro and web developer should master this skill. A Recon Ng is a powerful modular command line framework designed specifically for structured web reconnaissance. 
It provides security professionals and OSINT enthusiasts with a robust set of tools to gather information efficiently and systematically. With its intuitive interface, users can quickly get started even if they're new to reconnaissance frameworks. Think of Reconning as the Metasploit of OSINT. Just like Metasploit revolutionized penetration testing, Recon Aang brings a similar modular approach to open source intelligence. You can load a wide variety of modules to discover hosts, collect email addresses, uncover social media profiles, and much more, all from a single unified platform. Start by creating a dedicated workspace for each investigation, then add your target information. From there, you can chain together different modules, customizing your workflow to suit the needs of your specific project. This flexibility allows for both simple and complex investigations. All results are automatically stored in a built-in database, making it easy to track your findings, revisit previous discoveries, and build upon each piece of information you uncover. This organized approach streamlines the entire reconnaissance process. While reconning may not have a flashy graphical interface, its true strength lies in its high level of customization and the depth of its features. It's a tool built for technical users who value control and precision in their investigations. For those who want to extend its capabilities, Recon Ang supports custom module development in Python. This means you can tailor the framework to your unique requirements, integrating new data sources or automating repetitive tasks. In essence, Recon Ang is like a Swiss army knife for serious OSINT investigations. Versatile, reliable, and packed with features that empower you to uncover valuable intelligence efficiently and effectively. Have I Been Pyund lets you check if your email or phone number has appeared in data breaches. Enter your info, and it shows which breaches you're in and what was exposed. For OSINT, it reveals a target's online habits and old passwords. For everyone else, it's a crucial security check. Use unique passwords and enable two-factor authentication. Social Searcher is a real-time search engine for social media. Monitor names, usernames, or keywords across platforms like Twitter, Facebook, and Reddit. It pulls the latest public posts and provides analytics on sentiment, top users, and hashtags. Great for tracking trends, brands, or people of interest. The free version is perfect for quick high-level monitoring. Creepy visualizes geolocation data from social media posts, mapping a target's movements over time. It scrapes public posts for GPS tags, location check-ins, and EXIF data from photos. The result? A map of where someone's been, revealing patterns and key locations. While the original tool is outdated, the concept is vital. Many modern tools now offer similar features. It's a powerful lesson in OPSEC. Be careful what location data you share online. Your digital posts can reveal your real-world movements. The OSINT framework is a web directory of hundreds of OSINT tools, organized by investigation type. Click a topic, like email or domain, and it branches out to relevant tools and resources. It's a checklist and guide for structuring any investigation. Links go straight to each tool, making discovery easy. If you're stuck, start here. It's the index of the OSINT world. Hunter.io specializes in finding professional email addresses linked to any company domain. Enter a domain, and it returns emails, names, job titles, and sources. It can deduce common email patterns, letting you guess addresses even if they're not public. The free plan is great for small-scale use. For corporate reconnaissance or journalism, Hunter is a go-to tool. Twint is a Python tool for scraping Twitter data without API limits or developer accounts. It pulls tweets, likes, retweets, and more from users, keywords, or locations, fast and anonymously. Output data to CSV or JSON for analysis. Perfect for researchers, journalists, and anyone doing social media intelligence. Twint gives you access to Twitter's public data at scale, whose lookups reveal who registered a domain, name, email, address, and more. Even with privacy services, you can sometimes find historical records. It's a foundational step in any website investigation. Free lookup tools are everywhere and it's built into most operating systems. Simple but essential for mapping digital ownership. Pipple is a search engine for finding people, cross-referencing social profiles, public records, and more. It disambiguates common names by combining info like email, username, or location. Pipple builds detailed profiles from fragmented data used in fraud prevention and investigations. It's now paid only, but the concept is central to people-focused OSINT. Pipple shows how easily our online identities can be pieced together. Sherlock checks hundreds of websites for a specific username, revealing where someone has accounts. Just enter a username, and it returns links to all matching profiles. 
no passwords or APIs needed. It's open source, fast, and saves hours of manual searching. Great for mapping a target's digital footprint across platforms. Sherlock is a must-have for any OSINT toolkit. That's 15 powerful, free OSINT tools to uncover the digital breadcrumbs we all leave behind. Remember, with this knowledge comes responsibility. Always use these tools ethically and legally. Protect yourself, stay curious, but respect privacy and consent. Subscribe for more cybersecurity and digital forensics content. Thanks for watching. Stay safe and see you next time.